Well, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to a auto auction walk around. Today we're going to tour a auto auction here so join me. First up we've got a Jeep uh, Grand Cherokee Laredo. It actually does look pretty nice. You can see from in here where that shifter is. It's got a screen. Um, yeah, back part of it. The car is locked so I cannot get into it. The car is actually, it looks like it's in decent shape. The tires look like uh, they've been cleaned up a bit. Actually, the tires look like they're brand new. Um, yeah, I don't see a speck of rust on this at all. This, from the number up here, looks like it's a 2014. Um, next, we've got a Volvo. I haven't seen or dealt with a Volvo in a long time. Actually, I've never dealt with a Volvo, period. Um, it, that is locked again. The Volvo XC90, all wheel drive. Um, what do we got here? A Buick LaCrosse. This one's in pretty good shape. Um, yeah, it is a Buick LaCrosse. It's a 2005. Is this unlocked? Yeah, it is unlocked. Okay. I can actually see in here. Whew. It smells in here. It said it had 110,000 miles on it when I opened the door. But it disappeared real fast. It is automatic. Um, what have I got next here? A Hyundai Santa Fe V6. From what I can tell with these cars, looks like it's in decent shape. Yeah, except for here. A little bit of paint coming off. That's no biggie. Yeah. Car looks like it's in decent shape otherwise. Ah, what do we got here? A 2006... Let me see, is this a Toyota or is this a Mercedes? Let's see here, folks. This is a Toyota Solera. It's a V6. Okay. Got a, a Nissan Rogue right next to it. Automatic. I don't know if you guys could see that or not. Yeah, yeah. Um, Ford Focus is next. That's why I couldn't do it right. Sunroof. Gas saver, SES model. Okay. This is a Chevy Impala, if I'm not mistaken. It's a Chevy. Yeah, it's a 2012, as it says on the window. Clean LT model. That one's locked. I think this other Chevy Impala is the one that's open. Let me take a look. Yeah, this one's open. As you guys can tell, 231,000 miles on this. Whew! Okay. Got a Kia Soul next to it. Looks like it's got a little bit of rust here. And down here you got paint chipping off of it. Got a Nissan Altima. Kia Soul says it's a 2011 uh, 192,000 miles AC cold this is a 2011 Nissan Altima got a 05 well, I can't even tell what mark where that is but I a hard time seeing out of here in the sun Oh, it's an Acura. Okay. Is it unlocked? Yes, it is. Well, the only thing is it doesn't say how many miles are on it. 
Um, it is an automatic. Whew, hot as all heck in this car. Let's see. What do we got next? It's a Nissan. That's open. Oh yeah, definitely. Again, doesn't say what how many miles are on it. There's no key here. None of these have keys, but it is an automatic. Inside looks to be in perfect condition. Um, can't open the back unless. Let's see if it opens now. Yeah. Yeah. It's got like third row third row seats. Seems to be in perfect condition. Um there is a rodeo here. Isuzu rodeo. Say 2002. Seems to be in perfect shape for 2002. Except for under here is a little bit of rust, but that's no biggie. Got an E350 4Matic. Uh, I think this is another Acura. Tagged May of 2026. AC's good and super clean. Ah, oh, it's locked. Okay. I think it's an Acura or a Mercedes. Let's see here. Got a little uh, Dodge car here. It's a 2002. What you guys can see here. I know you can see me in the shadows here, but it's an automatic. Oh, it is open. Okay. Yeah. It says 130,000 miles on the odometer. Wow. Uh, radio's missing out of here. Yeah, this is a gas saver, more or less. Let's see. Got a Jeep Patriot here for sale. Uh, or up for auction, rather. Let's see if I can see what year it is. It's a 2011. And, oh. Uh, it's inoperable. Okay. So it's a non-runner. Got a Honda next to it. So I'm not big on the Hondas. Got a Dodge Ram 1500 Hemi 5.7 liter. It's a 2006 and it's inoperable. So it's a non-runner. Let's see. Oh, it is open. Whew. My God. Somebody did not take care of this really well. It is that dirty in here. Look at this. Seatbelt hooked up to the steering wheel. So, looks like somebody didn't take care of this all too well. Uh, Alright. Well, I'm going to walk back to the rest of the cars that they got here and see what they got good. I normally come to these auctions on Tuesdays. I haven't been here in a while. So I've had other things that have come up. So I wanna see what they got good back here. All right, folks, I'll be right back. All right, guys, part two. We got a Lincoln MKZ here. Uh, from that, to 2011. It says here it is a hybrid. So I don't know what they mean by that. It's in pretty decent shape on the inside. Seats all look pretty darn good. It's automatic. 
let's see, behind here, got a Ford, uh, let's see, it's a Ford what? Ford Expedition. Okay. Let's see. Oh, from the outside of it, it is a little, uh, dinged up a bit. Okay, it opens. It is automatic. Radio and all still here. Let's see, let's check the back out. Oh, seats are in perfect condition. It's third row seats in the back here. As you can see, the inside of it's taken really good care of. It's just the outside's a little dinged up right here. But all in all, it is a perfectly good car. Let's see. Got a Nissan Titan 5.6 SE. 4x4, off-roading. And it's a V8 Titan. Those Titan motors are not the best around. Let's just say that much. Hood needs a little bit of repainting. Actually, this whole front end needs repainting. Got a Chevy here. 2001. Uh, dinged up on the side here. Yeah, just says Chevy, Chevrolet here. Doesn't say what, what kind of Chevy it is. It does open. It is automatic. It doesn't say here because there's no keys. Seats are in decent shape, especially for the back. Ooh, my favorite. Chevy Trailblazer. These are supposed to be nice. Okay. It is automatic. Doesn't say how many miles are on it. Again, no keys. Seats are in decent shape. Car's in decent shape. Let's see what year this is. It's a 2007. Okay. It's not bad. Not bad for a car. What do we got here next? It's a Honda. Okay. I'm not a fan of Hondas, but still get it on video. Automatic. Locked. Apparently, this auction I come to locks their best cars. Next up we got a 2011 Chevy. It's a Chevy Equinox. Okay. For a car like this, it's pretty in good, pretty good shape. What have I got here next? Another Honda. I think this is a 2005 Honda Pilot, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a Honda Pilot. The only damage I see to it so far is this right here. And a little bit of rust right around here. And a little bit of damage here. That's, oof, I didn't see this, but this is damaged too. So. You have Hondas, Hondas. No idea what this is. Another Honda. Let me see what else they got here, folks. Ford F-150 the back of the bed. It's a 4x4. Four four. Got another Ford F-150. Here comes with a mattress. Guy only knows what the heck that came from. It's locked. Oh no, it's, a it's in pretty decent shape except for needing some cleaning. It's an XLT 5.4 Triton. 
Oh. Alright, well, that's it for right now.